I, I refuse to grieve for Archie's life. I, he, I am so honoured and feel he, he, his whole life was an absolute pleasure. I'm so honoured to have been Archie's mum, so I refuse to grieve. I'm more celebrating Archie's life. I, it was the best 12 years of my life. Well, could we talk about what led to this situation? And if you go yes. back to April, and often I find people aren't talking about this, do you mind talking to me about what he did or what you think that he did that, that put him in this situation? OK, so what we believe that Archie's done is possibly co um, copy an online challenge. And these online challenges are serious. They're... I've stated quite a few times, they're grooming our children. You know, these are adults that children look up to. Children don't look at adults and think for one minute they're going to put us in danger. Um, I have obviously started researching and absolutely horrified to watch grown men putting things around their neck, showing these children. Showing children what to do. And you feel that Archie copied this, did Correct. this, entered into this challenge? Yes, I do. And will there be any... Uh, progression on this front? Will there be any opportunity to to track down uh, someone who was at the other end of this or prosecute them or bring them to justice? I haven't really thought about the prosecution side. It, I think it's a hard thing because a lot of people obviously blame the parents, you know, you should mm. be monitoring your children, it's a blah, blah, blah. At the end of the day, we cannot watch our children 24-7. Archie's 12 years old. Uh, I'm, I'm pretty much behind Archie, like, or was behind Archie 24-7, you know. Yes, yes. There are times when they do require their own privacy or they want their own time out. And again, you can't always target the, pe the apps that are obviously doing these. Maybe a bit more needs to be done with regards to prosecuting the people who are actually demonstrating the videos, sure. you know, because there's, there's, they're yeah. obviously the children are copying. There's two things I want to ask you or say to you before we say goodbye and one is what would you say to the parents of young impressionable children children who spend a lot Vulnerable of their time children. online what would you say to those parents who would say oh he or she they're up there on that computer i don't know what they're doing just have the have the talk with them i think have the talk and make it very clear you know that there are dangers you know i was forever telling arch you know because he used to hide in pillar cases and things and that used to give me anxiety. Don't put things over your head. Don't have put things around yeah, your neck, yeah, you know. Yeah. It's just keep reinforcing the dangers and what could happen. Use Archie in the conversation. You know, this is what happened to this little boy because he thought one minute he was mucking around, he had his whole life ahead of him, and look what's happened. You know, and look look how sad his family are because he's, he's chose to copy something that has left him in this situation. We all know him because we know him through pictures on television and hearing reports on radio and things about him. And we know him through you. But we don't know him. We don't know him at all. Would you finally leave us with who Archie was, who he is, and how he'll live on with you? Oh, he, he will forever live on Archie. He's an absolute legend. He wanted to be a champion. And I believe he's gone out a champion. Champion what? Just a, a, he's just a champion. He's my little champion, and I think he's left an impact on everybody, and hopefully prevent a lot of people or a lot of children yeah. copying the same thing. He's he's brilliant. I love him to bits. He's brilliant. And you're going to be his champion forever. Yeah.